Hey everybody, it's Sunday. I uh, thought I'd do a check-in. Um, as far as uh, what the day is all about today, so I uh, had to sing at church this morning, day and a.m., and I tried to uh, put a little extra effort on the appearance. Um, first day of spring and all. So uh, I'll post a few pictures with this video as far as what I wore. Um, and then today, I actually just finished up. I, I have been neglecting my cardio for the last week or more. It's not good when one is trying to lean out, at least for this guy anyway. Um, so I did a very awesome uh, Peloton spin ride with uh, one of my favorite uh, riders, Alex Toussaint. So it's a new tracks, 30 minute kick ass class, which was really good, and then I uh, did a uh, five-minute uh, stretch uh, that he also does afterwards. So it was about 35 minutes end-to-end, -end, maybe 40 with my own personal warm-up because I was waiting for the session to start, and then I, um, so I probably think I burnt about 325 calories, so that was good, feel good, and then um, might try to get in a little bit of ab work at home because I'm not going to make it to the gym today. And then tonight, most exciting, my family and I are going to watch the newly released uh, Snyder version of Justice League. Very excited. Might even dress up to watch it anyway. Um, but uh, we watched the original 2017 version last night just to kind of refresh our memories. You know, I, I didn't hate the film. <laughs> I mean, I know it had some issues. I wasn't, honestly, when I look at the CGI, the whole mustache fiasco, I didn't think it was that. I mean, it was a little noticeable, but I mean, to get that upset about it, that wasn't my thing. I do acknowledge there are a lot of missing pieces when you really watch it that didn't really make sense when you did watch it, like the whole story and why things were happening and all that. So from what I've read online, it looks to be like a lot of those questions, those gaps are filled in pretty well by Mr. Snyder, and I guess that was part of his original vision. Um, so going, you know, cutting a film back from, I don't know, I can't imagine it would have been released in four hours anyway. I mean, I think the last film to be released with that length of time was Gone with the Wind, 1938 or something. So, um, but uh, in any event, looking forward to that. So that's about it for now. Hope you're all well. Uh, stay safe. And, um, we will uh, chat soon. God bless. Free band, October zone, it's the same shit.